hello everyone welcome to laravel 8 ap tutorial and in this video we are going to work on laravel delete api okay so uh, in last video we have seen that we able to delete the single records okay we able to delete the single records uh, with param by passing uh, the value in param by passing the record in param user id in param and uh, we able to do with json as well okay so now in this video we are going to delete the multiple records okay uh, last video we have removed the single records now we are going to uh, delete the multiple records and here you can see in users table now we want to uh, delete the uh, two or three records together okay so for that uh, there are two ways once again uh, one is we will send the ids in param like here we can set the ids by comma and then uh, we can explore those ids and we can delete in loop okay so another way is we can pass the ids in json array okay so here in json array we can pass uh, uh, the ids and then we can delete so first of all we are going to pass the uh, ids uh, in array uh, in param okay uh, so let's do uh, so first of all we are going to select the delete here and then url i can copy from here earlier url we can copy and i will do like this now here i will enter delete multiple users okay so now we are going to delete the multiple users so here i will mention delete multiple users here i will make it users okay so here ids will come like uh, i want to delete one three four three ids together one comma three comma four we will use the comma and we can use the api like this okay here we will use comma okay so i will create its api so i will go in api and here i am going to create the api for deleting multiple records multiple users delete api here we are going to delete multiple users with pair okay so here we are going to use route delete and we are going to use delete multiple users like we have done and here api controller and here delete multiple users so this function or oh, we can create in api controller so let's create this function public function delete multiple users and here we will uh, have the parameter as ids uh, multiple ids will come in comma so first thing is uh, we must check that how the ids are coming so uh, we can simply check here the ids it's the string okay so we will die so let's see first of all i will click on send and we'll check in response see no response is coming so we are going to check not found so we will check that it is fine or not delete hyphen multiple hyphen users so uh, the name is same api name must be same delete multiple users so it seems to be same so after that delete multiple users here as well so i will copy and will paste here so uh, so let's see once again uh, still it is not showing anything uh, we are going to check why it is not showing anything uh, okay so we are going to check once so here uh, we miss one thing we miss the ids here so that's why it is coming like this we missed to pass the ids as parameter of delete multiple users api okay uh, we miss in its route okay so here we need to pass the ids here now it must work fine so let's see uh, now uh, yeah now it is showing fine okay so don't uh, make the silly mistake at your end so we must pass the ids uh, so now uh, we will go back here and now we can explore uh, our ids uh, so we can uh, so, so we can simply here dollar ids and uh, we can explode 
and we can explore with comma okay so we have commas in this string uh, with uh, that is separating every id so uh, now uh, we will use this ids here the user now we are going to use the where in okay so instead of where we will use the where in that will accept the array now we are having the array as well okay so we are going to compare with the id and going to remove all the ids that comes in this array okay ids then we will use the delete uh okay delete method and here once again we can uh, do just check that what's coming it's coming in array or not okay so all the ids must come in array here because we have converted them to array uh, with explode okay so here we can check again and here you can see that all the ids are coming in array now okay so we can use this array to delete all at once we can use the wherein and we can delete and after that uh, we can use return response we can send this success message response uh, we can send this success message to our api json and here we can send message uh, users now we are going to mention users later successfully not users users later successfully okay uh, so we will uh, send the status code and here like i have explained in last video we have three kinds of status code we can pass okay uh, like we can pass 202 204 and 200 uh, 202 uh, with response uh, as accepted 204 with uh, no response at all and 200 with response as successful so we are going to use the 202 okay and you can use as per your own requirement we are going to use 202 that will show as accepted okay and will give the success message users later successfully so now i'm going to run this api and we are going to see that one three and four id will go away from the users table or not okay so let's see let's click on this one and here you can see the users later successfully message is coming with response code 202 accepted that we are giving there in api and we will check now one three and four id i'm going to refresh i'm going to click on browse once again and you can see the first three id is gone away okay one three and four ids are gone away and its details are deleted okay so three user details three users are deleted from our users table okay so this api is working fine and this one we are using with the param multiple param we are converting to array and we are deleting all at once okay so now we are going to use the delete api we are going to delete the multiple records with json with json array so sometime uh, we will get such kind of array that we want to remove from uh, our table not only users so maybe some other data as well that is coming in array so that we can use now i'm going to copy this api and uh, we'll uh, create one more delete api here and we'll uh, uh, save here and here i'm going to make it delete multiple users json okay like this i will uh, make this one in api but here i will send the uh, response in json string okay in json array so here response uh, here sorry request uh, i'm going to write here json request here uh, but make sure that request is correct okay so this time we are not passing single record we are passing the multiple records okay so uh, we will create one ids here uh, and inside this ids then we are going to create uh, like this one uh, and inside this we will pass we can pass the multiple uh, ids like uh, here id uh, we can uh, pass with five six okay so id is five and one more we can add it like this here id yeah, we can pass and we can try six id okay so we are passing multiple five six okay one more we can pass and we can pass the eight id as well so we can check this one is fine or not we can copy this uh, json uh, json 
uh, request and uh, we can check in jsonlink.com this website is really good website that uh, uh, will show that your json is valid or not okay i will click on valid json after copy the my json here I click on validation so valid json is coming so our json is valid so we can use the json okay so now uh, see uh, we are uh, will require the api here uh, route api route delete api delete multiple users with json okay so here we will add route lead lead multiple users and here we will add with json okay so here we will pass the api controller and here we are going to write lead uh, we can lead multiple users with json semicolon okay so i'm going to copy this function we are going to create this function here public function read multiple user with json now here we are going to use request dollar request okay so uh, we will have uh, the uh, here uh, we are going to use the if method and uh, we'll accept the data that will come in read method okay so here we will do like this is method here delete so all the records will come under this one and we are going to use the dollar user data dollar request all all or we can give input okay all we are going to give okay so here uh, now we will first check the data is coming fine or not echo dollar user data then die like this so first of all we are going to check this one click on send and uh, see its uh, result is also not coming uh, so once again do i am making one mistake for under four uh, so let's see what is the issue delete multiple users with json make sure our api is same delete multiple users okay so there is the mistake okay so now see the array is coming here all the ids are coming here zero one two okay so we are having it and uh, now we can try and uh, see we will use the for each loop now here so that we can get one by one record and we can remove all one by one okay so here we will simply give user data so and uh, now we can delete one by one record here we will give the user model here we will use here uh, uh, we can use here wear condition okay and uh, we will give id see one id will come at one one time dollar value and uh, delete see if we want to check that then we can check also i can comment this one so first of all we will check the value will come up here or not okay so we can just simply give a like this echo dollar value so what's what will come in value okay we can check here okay so it is uh, coming uh, we can simply check okay so it is coming in array okay so value is coming in array uh, so no issue here uh, we can check it like this one uh, if it is coming in array uh, so we can check in array what's coming here we can do like this and see okay five six eight so see uh, we are uh, having uh, a, a, a value in array so we can delete all at once here as well okay so we can uh, delete here wherein we can use and 
nothing else to use here okay so we can move all but there is another way to uh, use i think so we can test with that i if i can use straight away uh, see here we can use here user data and user data and inside this one we can use the id so let's see if it will work so once we will experiment with this one uh, okay so i'm going to use here id so let's see here uh, okay user data id is not showing okay id is okay fine id is okay so uh, all the ids are coming inside this one uh, so first of all we can try this one and if it will work fine uh, then it's good for us okay so let's see i'm going to click on send and under friend index id uh, okay sorry here ids will come so try once again so now we can check 568 id is there in our table or not yeah gone away okay so this one is working uh, see for each loop is not required so it makes our task really easy uh, see this one is coming in array we can pick all the ids uh, in that is uh, we are passing in json array okay so we can get and we will use the wherein once again and we can move all at once okay uh, so uh, this uh, just this success message uh, is required here okay so nothing else is required okay so now see how much easy our task is see we are getting in uh, json array we are accepting here the array we are getting in user data and user data ids we are just passing in uh, uh, in our query and to delete all the records all the users at once okay so uh, we are going to try once again and this time i am going to pass only few users are left 9 13 okay i am going to pass 9 13 and 14 9 13 and 14 so let's try with these three records i will click on send and here the error uh, here the message is coming uh, success message is coming 202 accepted user data successfully and we can check here in our table and these three records are deleted three three users have been deleted fine okay so it's working fine uh, you can uh, check you can test uh, in postman these uh, all these delete methods all these delete apis at your end and if you will find any issue you can surely contact me okay so that's all for now have a nice time goodbye